Welcome to Is A Guy Easting, where the facts and folk tales of our beautiful Guyana are featured. We all know about the world's largest single drop waterfall, the Kaichur Falls. But do you know how it got its name? The word Kaichur means old man's falls. The Kaichur Falls was named after Kai. The most popular tale of Kai tells us of the Tushau. Kai was a Patamona, one of the nine tribes of the indigenous people who came to Guyana. Kai wore a tall, colorful headdress made of feathers of the rarest birds. A piece of animal hide covered his loin. He was brown-skinned, short, and muscular, like many of our indigenous people. Many years ago, before the Kaitra Falls was named, there lived a peaceful tribe of the Patamonas on the Pataro. Not very far away lived a warish tribe of Caribisi, commonly known as Caribs. The Caribs were a ferocious set of Amerindians. They fought among themselves to prove bravery. The Caribs fought to win the domination of other tribes as a show of power. The Patamonas were no exception to this sick power battle. The Caribs regularly raided and tormented the village. After being steadily attacked by the Caribs, the village chief at the time, Kai, sought for a peaceful way out. He prayed humbly to the Makonaima, the great spirit of their people. This great spirit does not have a physical form and is never seen by the mortal man. Makonaima spoke to Kai and he listened. One day, in an act of self-sacrifice, Kai took his wooden canoe and paddled faithfully over the waterfall. This was done in exchange for the protection of his tribe. He selflessly gave up his life in exchange for peace rather than start a war between the tribes. This is proof in itself of how harmonious and peace-loving the Patamonas were. It is said that Kai's canoe lies at the bottom of this great falls and has been turned to stone. How many of you have visited the wonderful Kaichur Falls? Stay tuned for many more facts and folk tales right here on Isagayanese Thing.